Good morning, class! Mellow greetings, Yuki Dookie. Live long and prosper. Okay, here we go. It's a new week, week two. Here we go. Welcome. Today is Monday, April 6th, 2020. All together, guys. Nicely done. Okay, so our uh, little comic here today, we've got Charlie Brown and Linus. And Linus comes up to Charlie Brown and says, Hey, manager, do you think this game will be over by dark? And Charlie Brown says, well, I hope so. Why? Linus says, I have no desire to be chomped by a night snake. Charlie Brown says, a night snake? Once you get chomped by a night snake, you've had it says Linus. Is that kind of silly to worry about that? Yeah. I think we need to make sure that we're saving our worries for important stuff. That's especially true these days. Okay. And our uh, inspirational saying for the day, uh, this is a Japanese proverb. We don't know the actual name of the person who said this. But it says here, fall seven times get up eight. That may sound kind of, what does that mean? Well, it means no matter how many times you fail, you keep up getting up and you, you keep trying because you don't actually fail at something until you stop trying. All right. All right. So our daily schedule here, again, starting out with the morning math. Uh, our story this morning is the Royal Raccoon. That's a good one writing we're going to do another DOL and don't forget there is the tutorial that is on the website uh, break we're gonna do some Alexia using your your clever login and then we're gonna do something new remember I told you guys last week I thought that the the phonics and the handwriting was on like, mm, I don't know how useful that is <clears throat> well one of the things our school now has a license to is something called Raz kits and whereas Lexia kind of takes reading apart into all the different pieces and stuff like that, uh, Raz Kids, I believe, is more reading comprehension. So it has all these different levels of books, and uh, you read them, and then it has little kind of quizzes on it to see if you understand what's going on. And so along with the packet that I'm sending home today, it will be a sheet that explains how to log on and it's got your, I created usernames and passwords for everybody. So that's how that works. Um, let's see here. So hopefully that'll work. Uh, then we have recess. You got to run out there, stretch your legs. Boy, yesterday it was like sunshine, rain, sunshine, rain. Who knows? Uh, our specials today is library. And I found this cool website. You know how we do our read aloud YouTubes? Well, I, I like those, but you're kind of getting me over and over and over again. It'd be nice to have somebody else for a change. And so Storyline Online um, is a website, and it's just like this virtual library, and somebody, there's all these different people um, reading different stories. So you get to choose the person, you can choose what story, and all that stuff. Uh, so we have our lunch and recess, get some nummy nummies in the tummy. Our chapter book, this is our last chapter of Ribsy. So tomorrow we start a new chapter book. So uh, you'll be listening to that online and then coloring the packet page. Uh, for math, we're going to do another graph diagram. Again, the tutorial is on the website. Uh, you have your sharing page. Uh, so far, we've got two people that I was able to upload to the website and I think another two that are on Facebook. So we've got a total of four people. Um, recess, and then what I'd like you to do for the end of the day, um, I've had this on the website, but I, I haven't done much with it. Um, Mo William, Willems is the author of the Elephant Piggy and the Pigeon Books and, and Nuffle Bunny and a whole bunch of other stuff. And he has been doing these lunch doodles, lunch doodles with Mo Willems. And so each video is, I'm going to say it's 20 to 30 minutes. 
and they're kind of tutorials on how to draw and things. Um, so we're gonna, I'm going to have you do that and see if you can use some of his tips to uh, work on your drawing. And I was just watching an episode, I won't tell you which one it is yet, but uh, he had a guest on there, Dan Santac. So, all right, there is Monday. Let's go get him.